Hey guys, I'm Satorio Phil. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a more detailed video on one of the rings I picked up in my last jewelry haul. So it's from Cartier. It comes in the standard red box. This is the Acru ring. This is in 18 karat yellow gold. They also make this in the pink gold and in the white gold version. It is the Acru ring, which translates to nut in English which are these metal pieces here because this is like a nuts and bolts. The screw is the bolt and then these are the nuts that go on it. And they are movable. There are five in total, but one is stationary. So this one happens to be the one you can't move because of the way they welded it together. You need one piece where it all connects the, the entire, I guess, ring. So that does mean you can move the rest of them and you can play around with where you want them to be. So if you want to concentrate them on one side when you wear them, or you can spread them out evenly. It does change the fit of this. If you spread them out, I think that's more of the standard size that it's listed at. When you put them all in one side, the ring becomes larger, which does mean you could play around with potentially which finger you wear them on. The yellow gold and the pink gold version retails for 2210 and the white gold version is 2360 And these would make really great gifts, I think. I don't have information backing it up, but I feel like these would probably be more popular as men's items because they're very industrial looking. Obviously, that's not to say that women don't like them either, but just looking at their portfolio of products, I feel like this is one of the more kind of traditionally masculine designs. So I usually like wearing it on my index or pointer finger. And due to the facets of each of these nuts, it catches the light really well. So it's actually pretty shiny and brilliant, even though there aren't any gemstones on this. And I would just normally wear them spaced apart pretty evenly. And it's kind of fun to play with when it's on your finger too. So throughout the day, you can kind of be adjusting it. So when it's spaced out evenly, I just feel like it has balance and it looks similar from all angles and basically my pointer finger and my middle finger are just about the same so I can use them interchangeably. It won't fit my ring finger necessarily. I mean it would be way too loose. But I always think rings just look better on my pointer or middle finger and it helps me get a larger size which helps you show off more of the ring. This also comes in a diamond version and it has baguette diamonds on each facet of each of the nuts. And it does increase the price quite dramatically because it's not a pave diamond effect. So the diamonds are larger and because it's a baguette cut. And I think I did see either the bracelet version or the ring version in person. And it does look really nice. It, the diamonds add a lot of sparkle. But I think for me, my preference would still be for the gold version and I would for the price of the diamond one I would consider getting the bracelet as well so I could get the ring and the bracelet and in this video I also wanted just to compare the color of Cartier so right now I have on the love ring in pink gold on my ring finger and Cartier's pink gold isn't that pink so the difference is a bit more subtle between yellow and pink gold but I think they're there definitely is a difference, especially when you place them closer together. So you can see, of course, the pink gold is a bit more rosy than the yellow gold. I also have the Clash, which is in the in-between color. So the Clash is like almost a 50-50 mix of pink gold and yellow gold. So the color is in between them. but. That also helps it work well to pair it with yellow gold because it'll look more like yellow gold when you pair it with yellow gold 
And when you pair it with pink gold, it's going to look more like pink gold. So here are three different Cartier rings in three different materials. You have 18 karat yellow gold. They still call this pink gold, but it's a paler pink than their original pink gold. And these both are 18 karat as well. And all of these designs are pretty much, it wraps all the way around it. With the exception of the A crew, you can adjust it so that it looks a bit different. So for example, if I wanted them to place them closer together, so like that, and then one more over here, since this is the stationary one. It does make it a bit looser, but it does change the look quite dramatically. So you can kind of play around with it depending on what your taste is. And maybe in some point you just want the simple spiral, I think is a different look as well. Much cleaner look. You see like the ribbings. And then you can, of course, turn it back to have all of the nut details. And then you can spread them out evenly as well. And that's my video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Check out my Instagram at Satorial Phil for the latest updates and exclusive content. Thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video.